Welcome back to Skyrim. Um, we're at High Rockguard and talking to the Greybeards. Um, so we'll figure, we'll finish, uh, what they need me to do. And then we'll go and check on our household and all that good stuff. We'll figure out what, um... <laughs> we'll now see how you learn a completely new shot. Okay. Master Bori will teach you wood, which means whirlwind. You must hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thumb. Master Bori, and he will gift you this knowledge of wood. Master Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. <coughs> then it will be your turn. Okay. Master Bori. Rex. <coughs> Wolf. Okay. Woo! Now, Where the turn. flash? Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to equip it first. Okay. Okay. Open the door. There we go. Your quick mastery of a new thume is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself? You were given this gift by the gods for a reason. It is up to you to determine how best to use it. Okay. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jürgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrad. Remain true to the way of the voice. I will return. Sounds good. Why the dragons returning does it have something to do with me? No doubt. The appearance of a dragon born at this time is not an accident. Your destiny is surely bound up with the return of the dragons. Uh, you should focus on honing your voice, and soon your path will be made clear. Okay. Uh, thank you. I will continue my training. Good. Then you will be ready for whatever lies ahead. Mm. Okay. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Sky above. Come, Barbus. We need to, um... Hold on. Where we gotta go? Hold on, hold on. Maybe I should actually... I retrieved the horn. Okay. Back this way? I don't remember. I had... Ooh, I gotta go all the way over there. Oh, dang it. Like, the abandoned shack and everything is all the way over here. Alright. What? Bandit. Oh, you're pathetic. Uh, what? Whoa, wrong shout. This whole branch. Oh, what happened? 
What happened to this bandit? Okay. Well, one thing, um, I probably will. This doesn't give me any hope. Anything good being inside here. Why is everybody dead? I don't remember doing this quest. I've done it like a long time ago. Um, but I don't. Is it nothing but necromancers in here? Like, why is- why are they attacking him? <gasps> Princess Necromancer. <gasps> Golly. It's a little- a little excessive, huh? Alright. Let's search this. Ooh. Give me that bread. Not <laughs> Come, Barbus. I have bread. Let's go. Um Am I going the wrong way? Probably. Probably. Ha! Invisibility potion recipe? Interesting. What is going on in here? A princess fire mage? Not even worried about me. sword book invisibility potion ice wraith teeth and a charis eggs okay I need to go dump all of this Ooh, bound sword too bad I don't use swords I need I need that bound up. I need that bounce bow um, conjuration spell, but I I need to get my conjuration up. What is this? What's in there? Nothing. Kind of weird. Uh... Oh, there's a chest in here. Potion of water breathing. Maybe I should save that and go back to where that sunken treasure boat is. Arbus, move. I don't even. I don't even know where I'm going in here. But I'm finding potions, so not a terrible. Hold on, there's jewels in here. I do need to find some, what, some, is it amethyst? I'm not searching all of that, but it's some amethyst, flawless amethyst for that Argonian that wants to propose. Am I going the wrong way? I, I have no idea. Ouch. I 
all these coins? Oh, I didn't want to take that. All right, um, uh, hmm. I'm going somewhat in the right direction, I guess. This is a confusing place. Ooh, hey. Yes, I want to go through the door that has the skeletal remains right in front of it because that doesn't make me feel comfortable good at all. One, I don't know where Barbus went. He's just off gallivanting somewhere. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm I did not see the pressure plate of that. Where am I? Am I? to be going in the right direction, right? Like, I'm so con- I've never been so confused in a level before. I guess I'm going in the right direction because there's a live, um, enemies, so... Cheese. I mean, there's somebody. He's. It's coming down the stairs for me, so. Oh, it's a restless one. I didn't want to pick, keep picking it up. Silver. Uh, that. Okay. Okay, that's a dead end. I don't know why I'm just very confused in here. Something was gonna happen.
First of all, I don't know if I'm supposed to go that way or the other way or what? What is going on? Torment arrows, got it. Got that. Uh, lock picking. I mean. Okay. Kind of quiet without Barbus following me around. Mm. I almost miss his barking. <laughs> Not really. He barks way too much. All right. bunch of skeletons in here. Archers, look at this guy. Right there, just, just. <sighs> Sitting on his throne. Oh, I know, what is this? Take Garnet, take Flawless Garnet. Oh my goodness. He is shooting arrows at me. There he is. Excuse the dog in the background. <laughs> it's not one dog barking, it's another. I think I had mail come to the door. taking that because I'm going to set off some kind of trap. Okay. So there is some stone thing down here. If there's spriggans down here, I hate spriggans. They're beautiful. I'm just, I don't like fighting them. There's a dragon shout thing, my bobber down here. Fade become eternal? Ethereal? I will mispronounce things. I will not say them correctly. <laughs> Just fair warning. Is that... That can't be it, huh? Did I miss something? Okay. Up. 
Sorry for the loud waterfall. Let's see. I think I need to go in up there, in there. Where, how do I get back up there? Hope I can. Oh, my goodness. What's this way? Hold on, hold on. I don't think I went this way yet. So I need to use that new shout that they that they gave me. Um, it's marked with that. Come, them reaches out the void, changing your form to one that cannot harm or be harmed. So this shout makes me like immortal for uh, I guess a couple minutes. Okay. First of all, before I go that way, I kind of remember this section right now, and I hate it doing this. Okay. I hate this show. I I'm gonna be honest. I just don't don't care for it. At least I can get that one open. Ugh. All right. Oh, come on. I have to get through all of them. I have to get through all of them before they close. I hate this. With a passion. mic on. <laughs> I hate it. I finally, finally did it. Okay. Ah. Okay. Oh, shoot. Get, 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 pop, 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 pop. Oh, good. Great. Get <gasps> out of my face. Should have saved. I should have saved. What? What? <gasps> oh. Save, save, save your game because who knows what will happen, and I don't want to do that again. Ah. 
Oh, and run. And run. 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 Huh? Ah. Come on, Mama. Oh, 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 Mom. Oh, oh I hate this. Giant frost spider. Why are you not dying? Come on. Oh. Healing, minor healing. <gasps> I know I'm poisoned. Oh! <laughs> Lucky me! You can stay right there. In the flames. Nope. God dang it. Go back. Our little red spots, but I don't know what that's at. Alright. Open the wooden door. Get me the heck out of here. What's in there? Because I'm not doing that trial again. Give me the horn. Okay. Failed. Retrieve the horn. What? Meet with whoever took the horn. Dragonborn, I need to speak with you urgently. Recent rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood and I'll meet you, a friend. Do I need let's take the note. Well, well, well. <sighs> At least there's a treasure chest at the end. Unless they took that too. Dwarf and bow. Oh, wait. Ah! Uh. I mean, I know I should be taking everything. Don't really want to. I could sell it. We'll see. Oh, Lord, where am I? Get me out of here. I don't like this place at all. Uh, we'll go return our, we'll go, um, we'll check in on our kid, we'll, um, we will go and go return, not return, but go check in with the Dark Brotherhood, um, to receive our, I guess our bounty. Where am I going? I don't even know where I'm going. Get me out of here. <coughs> Barbus, where were you? Somewhere being useless, I guess. Okay. I'm not going to Marthal right now. I'm just too frustrated to even go and do all of that. Let's go to Golden Hills Plantation. I sent um, the kid there. Um, let's see. Hills is still here. I don't know where anybody else is at. Um, 
Um, beep beep, beep beep. Okay, so there are two beds in here. Great, because that's. <gasps> this is, this is great. It's everything Look. I could have asked for. A I, I know it's not much, but I found a few little things. I put them in the chest in my room. If you see anything you want, take it. You've done so much for me. It's the least I can do. Let's see how much how much money do I have, and I could probably spruce up this place a little bit more. When I grow up, I'm going. Yeah, you're gonna be an assassin. I got it. Hey, Eric. It's great to see you again. It's been too quiet without you around. Um, good. I like to buy some of course. furnishings. What room would you like me to furnish? Let's do the kitchen. Very good. I'll make all the arrangements. I'd better get going. How much money do I have? Three thousand. I'd better get going. Good to okay. see you. Okay. How would you Let's like? Do some furnish. Some more furnishings. What room would you like me to furnish? Um, I might as well just buy everything. Let's Very see. good. I'll make all the. If I can. Until next time. I'll be broke. But. It just feels right somehow. It of does. Of course. What room would you like? Very good. Mm -hmm. At first, I thought I'd make. Of course. What room would you like me to furnish? The loft. Very good. I'll make all. Until next time. Nice. Okay. Come on. Look how nice it is in here now. You have a proper home. There's no sacrificing going on on the floor. Um. All of this is cleaned up. Look how nice. We have rugs. We have all the things. Wait, hold on. Let's go upstairs. <gasps> Look how nice. And there's a sweet roll on the table for us. Good deal. Nice. Now Aventus has a proper home for all you of us. Need something, Ma? Oh. You're back. Great. Oh, hey. It's great to see you again. Let's collect the plantation's Very profits. Good. What? Two thousand dollars or two thousand gold? I could purchase a horse. Um, your services are soon. Okay. I don't want to buy a horse. Mm-hmm. Uh huh. Okay. Good afternoon. Nice. Okay. Let's go and um check in with the Dark Brotherhood. I'm not gonna. Mm, I could go over there and do that. But let's do this. Mother is mother to all. It is her voice we Oh, I didn't uh, run into Cicero on the road. I've, ha I've had that happen. And he breaks be down somewhere. Punishment? Keep talking, little man, and we'll see who gets punished. Oh, be quiet, you great lumbering lapdog. The man has had a long journey. You can at least be civil. Mr. I like Cicero, how he has no shoes on. I, for one. And delighted you and the night mother have arrived. Your presence here signals a welcome return to tradition. Not a fan of Cicero, just oh, FYI. What a kind and wise wizard you are. Sure to earn our lady's favor. You and the night mother are of course welcome here, Cicero. And you will be afforded the respect deserving of your position as keeper. Understood, husband? <laughs> Her. Oh, yes, yes, yes! Thank you, thank you, thank you! 
But make no mistake. I am the leader of this sanctuary. My word is law. Are we clear on that point? Oh, yes, mistress. Perfectly. You're the boss. Ah, there you are. Good. I was done speaking with that muttering fool anyway. We've got some business to discuss. Okay. I do indeed. You must go to the city of Markarth and speak with the apothecary's assistant. You'll probably find her in the Hag's Cure when the shop is open. The girl's been running her mouth. Wants an ex-lover killed. She's apparently performed the Black Sacrament. Her name is Muiri. I need you to talk to her, set up the contract, and carry it out. Just do whatever the contact wishes. Be professional, represent us well, and get the job done. Since it's your first contract, I'll let you keep whatever Muiri pays. She'll be generous, I'm sure. They always are. Everything is making me go to Markarth. Good grief. Alright. Where is um, Nazir? I heard about what happened. You're referring to that blacksmith contract? Yeah, there he is. He's usually in here. Unless he's sleeping. I see you. Good. Your payment for a job well done. Four hundred, not bad. Congratulations. You slaughtered an emaciated beggar in cold blood. You are truly an opponent to be feared. Here's your payment. I love the sarcasm. Of course she is. I hear the mining business is extremely cutthroat. And those uh, hours, uh, uh. the murder. I could do this all day. <laughs> Here's your payment. Okay. Do you have any more? I'm not gonna ask You've any got more contracts. To kill my friend. Best get to it. Because you like creeping round in the shadows. Magical work just kind of scared the bejesus out of me. But okay. Let's see, so I have a contract for her, I have a contract, I need to go meet with whoever took the horn. Um, this also, I have to go to Markarth, Mark Markarth. <sighs> Dang it. This is also in Markarth. There is anywhere else. I guess we're going to Markarth. Oh, Cicero, what are you? Ah, another member of the family. Hello, hello. So very good to meet you. Uh, it's good to meet you. So polite, so nice. Cicero likes you. The night Boy. mother is sure to like you too. Oh, we're going to be fast friends. Fast friends. The night mother's crypt in Breville was desecrated. The imperial province is ravaged by strife. Nowhere there is safe at present. Okay. So Cicero brought our lady to her new home. Here, this is the only sanctuary left in all of Skyrim, you see. Such was my honor as keeper. Oh, what? Who is the Night Mother? Oh, oh, you jest. <laughs> you jest with gullible Cicero. <laughs> you, of course, know that the Night Mother is our unholy matron. The undying spirit of a great woman who birthed oh, the children of do. Sithis. And killed them <laughs> in his honor. 
All right, I'm not talking Kill to you anymore. Well. And often. Let us. Oh, I do wish to get to know you better. Uh, get away from me. The mother. Maybe we can talk for the get away from Cicero. Somebody threw a cart in the middle of the road. <laughs> okay. Um, instead of going to Markoth right now, I'll save that for our later, for the next episode. Um, and I will go and stay in the inn at, uh, in this village. <laughs> Hopefully a cart doesn't get thrown at me. Ugh. You're nothing but trouble. Okay. <gasps> Dorothy, nothing but trouble, you jerk. Are you trying to starve the child? What? I Starve the child. Alright. You're th I'm the innkeeper. I like to it's rent the attic to keep room. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. Ooh, she gave me the side eye. Is it this which one? Oh. So you're the dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. We need to talk. Yes, we do. Me. Okay. You gotta give me. You gotta refund my money. A nice room. Close the door. Okay. Now we can talk. You Batman? It's like a bat cave in here. Look at you! Look at all of this. It's nice. Got your little woman cave down here. Okay. Ooh. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. Uh, you're the one that took the horn? Surprised? I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. What's with all the cloak and dagger? You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. Okay. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I'm not I saying anything. I just need you to hear me out. I'm trying. Stop being so hostile. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. Okay. I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were Dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeards sent and not some Thalmor plant. If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. We remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate Dragon Slayer. Okay. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Oh, lady, have I devoured uh, a lot of them. Good, and you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. <sighs> okay. So what's the part you're not dragons telling me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. Me? Um, do you know how crazy that sounds? What makes you think dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty. 
and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. Okay. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, so where are we headed? Pines Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Okay. I'm not ready to go yet. Um, so you- hold on. I can't wait around for you to make up your mind. I'll meet you at Kynes Grove. Don't waste time getting there. I need to prep. Can I grab some stuff? Or are you gonna be mad at me? That's better. Let's get on the road to Kynes Grove. You- I will meet you there. I wanna, I wanna make sure I have uh, something, some better armor. Oh shoot! Not you there. You're the one they call Dragonborn. No. Then it is too late. The lie has already taken root in the hearts of men. So we shall expose to them the falseness in their hearts. By tearing out yours, deceiver. Great. When Lord uh, appears, can you help me? Shall bear Are witness. you just gonna leave? None I shall stand to oppose him. Whoa, where did that thing come from? Oh, good. She did stay to fight with me. Awesome! Dragon's tongue? What is this? It's a flower. Okay. Cultist robe. Cultist mask. Give me that. Put it up in my collection. Cultist orders. Okay. This is another. This is uh, expansion. Um, that I will not go there yet. Uh, let's, but we'll read it. Cultist orders. Um, travel to Sol's. <laughs> it's like the Dark Mage area. Blood Dark Mage, yeah. Um, port port of uh, Morrowind. Um, an island off of there. Uh, board the vessel Northern Maiden docked at Raven Rock. Take it to Windhelm. Then begin your search. Kill the false dragonborn known as Kali before she reaches a them. Return with word of your success. And Merrick shall be most pleased. Well. Well, well, well. Um, I'm going to end the episode here. I'm going to um, empty out my pockets. Do some... Um, I guess make sure my, my weapon's up. I might need to I'm gonna go buy some stuff, get prepared, um, and then we will continue on our journey. Um, the next episode, I might make it to Markov to uh, do some more of the Dark Brotherhood. So, stuff like that. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, basically, the good thing about this game is that you can just play and make it up as you go. Um, so, thank you everybody who has stopped by. You leave things around and trip over. <laughs> Shouldn't leave things around the trip over. Oh my goodness. I hope everybody has a great day, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.